Konnichiwa, Tiffany Rika des. So welcome back to my channel. And today I am uh, carrying my backpack, not because I'm going back to school, but because I wanted to show you guys what I carry with me to work in my backpack. I thought it was kind of in the realm of back to school, kind of. So, you know, um, I can't really do back to school videos because I'm too old for that now. But I really wanted to show you guys what I carry in my bag, how I organize it, and everything that I take to work. So uh, let's get into it. <laughs> So this is the backpack that I carry with me to work. I absolutely love this one. It's on Amazon. Um, the company is called Beba More, and I will leave a link to it down below if you guys are interested. On the keychain strap here, I do have a cute little heart Jill Stewart uh, keychain. Uh, this is from Japan, and um, I absolutely love it. I think it just gives a little spice to the backpack. Um, in the side pockets here, I do have my bus pass because for right now I do commute. Um, the office is moving closer to me, so I'm super excited for that. It's just gonna be such an easy thing when your commute is only 15 minutes. Love it. Um, and then usually on this side, I do keep a water bottle in here, but for right now, it's in the dishwasher. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and start, I guess, with the bigger pocket here. So this is what the inside of the bag looks like. Honestly, this is why I purchased the bag. It has so many different compartments in it, and there's so many places to put everything, and it just is the best thing for an organization freak um, or someone who wants to be an organization freak and get their life together, so. Um, the first thing, it's in the laptop sleeve here, is my laptop. This is my work laptop. It has my little work mascot on it, and every time I take a business trip with them, I always put um, the state sticker on it because we do have state-themed um, dino stickers. So I think that's really cute. and. I really love it, and I really love how light this one is because my other one is so heavy, I can't carry it with me anywhere. The next big thing that I have in here is my passion planner. Now, I just got on this trend. It's been around for a while, but I love planning. If you guys have seen some of my past videos, I did try to do like a plan with me. If you guys want me to do that, I could do that again, but I got this beautiful passion planner. It's in a rose gold color. Um, it's a really, really big planner, so um, for people who want a smaller planner, uh, they do have a smaller size, but I just love, love, love planning. Um, just planning out everything, putting in to-do lists, and this gives me the space to do that. In here, there are a lot of different pockets on the sides. Starting off with this side pocket, I always keep some type of protein bar with me because I am always on the go and definitely get hungry during my work hours. Uh, this is the RX bar in the coconut chocolate. This is my absolute favorite protein bar. I guess this is like more of the fun stuff, I guess. Um, this is my pencil case. This is a Ipsy glam bag that I turned into a pencil case. It has Gudetama on it and I was like, Okay, this is set. It's gonna be my pencil case. Um, so I don't actually use it as a makeup pouch. I just keep all of my pens in here. These are all of the Muji pens. And then this is a Japanese brand pen called Sarasa. And I absolutely love it. My boyfriend actually gifted that to me. So I keep all of those in there. And then I have another pouch. I do like organizing things in pouches because I think it's just so much easier. You know which pouch is meant for what. And it's just nice to have it in compartments. I'm such an organization freak that this is something that I love to do. Uh, this purple one is from Japan, and I do keep my slim Seagate hard drive in here. And this is actually for all my YouTube videos because I have taken up way too much space on my two terabyte computer, and now I have to go to this. So I do keep that in there so I can edit for you guys when I'm on the train. In the next compartment, I do have my wallet. This is from the brand Elise, and this is a Japanese brand. I really like it. It's compact, but it fits a lot in it, um, and it has a cute little bow, so. This is probably the best part of this bag. This is like my beauty little corner pocket. Um, the first thing that I have in here is the full size of the Bowshell Rosewater Mist with Witch Hazel um, Facial Mist. And this stuff is absolutely amazing. I was planning on doing like a um, beauty on the go video. Are you guys interested in something like that? I love spraying this on my face to keep my face moisturized throughout the day. So I keep a full size of that in here. 
is my Jill Stewart makeup pouch and this actually came in a Japanese magazine. They have something called a furoku which is like a free gift that you get every month and this was part of it. So, 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 so cute. Um, and it comes with two zippers. The first pocket has all of my beauty items for that day. So I do have always on me the Kim Make uh, Transparent Finishing Powder. So this is a transparent finishing powder, as I said in Japanese. So this is the beige version, um, and it looks like this. It's so nice when you're getting really sweaty and just to blot everything off, and it's actually such a cute packaging, so why wouldn't I wanna carry it? And the next thing I have in here is the Noonie Appleberry Lip Oil. Um, this is the revitalizing and tinting lip oil. Um, also in here, I do have a chapstick. This is the candy cane chapstick. It's still, um, I bought like a huge pack of the candy cane chapsticks because they're amazing um, during last Christmas and I still have one more left, so. And then I have two lip products here. The first one is the Cam Make Stay On Balm Rouge. I did mention picking this up in my Japan beauty haul from January or February, I think, uh, when I came back from Japan. And this stuff is absolutely amazing. I have so many of these and they are amazing. They are like a chapstick that's tinted but it has such a nice tint to it. Look at how tinted that is. And it moisturizes your lips, it tints your lips, and it actually stays on a very, very long time. So I have that as well as the K Palette Lasting Lip Tint uh, One Day Tattoo Lip Gloss in the color Lasting Lip, lip color 3, D3. So this one, it's just my everyday kind of like pink gloss and it goes really well with this can make one which is why I carry it with me. But these do change out quite a bit depending on what lip color I'm wearing. Um, and the last two things in here are the Sam Tip Concealer in number one and then also my Rollerball Perfume. Ugh, rollerball Perfume. This is the Versace Bright Crystal. I only have a little bit left so I do have to pick up another one. But this is an amazing scent. If you guys ever have a chance to go into Sephora and smell it, Definitely do that. In the back pocket here, I do have a hand cream. This is the Ahava Dead Sea Water Mineral Hand Cream. I've never thought about carrying this before until uh, I grew up and realized that when I eat and I get pasta sauce all over my white shirts, um, and that was a problem to carry this around. Uh, this is the Tide To Go Mini Stick, and it actually really does help, so I do have that in there um, for all the times I go out and spill spaghetti sauce on my white shirt. All those things were in the pockets in the sides, and in the middle, I do keep a puffer jacket. This is a Uniqlo puffer jacket. Um, it folds up really, really small. This is actually my boyfriend's. Um, he gets mad at me for wearing it all the time, but it's so nice because it keeps you warm, but it also just folds down really, 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 really small, and I can just throw it in my backpack. Like, look at, that's the size of it, and you could keep squeezing it more if you wanna. That's how small it is, and I just throw it in there because San Francisco, the weather changes so much, I definitely need one of those, and I probably should buy my own because my boyfriend might get cold now that I've stolen his jacket. And in the front pocket here, I don't think I have that many things. Yeah, okay, I have this little pink, like, sphere thing um, that has my headphones in it. And then also, sometimes I do keep, like, memory cards in here if I just had filmed a video and didn't have time to um, throw it onto my laptop yet. I do keep that in there as well as a pack of gum. <laughs> So that was the end of this video. I really hope you guys enjoy that. Um, show you guys what I carry to work with me. Maybe you guys can implement that somehow into your back to school backpack. Um, thank you guys so much for the support as always. Guys, we have just hit 5,000 followers on my Instagram. Make sure to go ahead and go ahead and check, go ahead and go ahead. Go ahead and check that out. Um, I do upload more on a daily basis over there. Um, you guys can see some fashion pics, um, any of the products that I'm using, Using, stuff like that behind the scenes of my YouTube videos all that goes there so go ahead and check it out and also if you guys haven't done so already make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button the notification bell all that kind of stuff I don't know what YouTube is up to but I want my subscribers to be able to see my videos so go ahead and do that thank you guys so much for watching as always and I'll see you guys in my next video Matane. Mm -hmm.